Hello everyone, welcome to class series and in this video, we're gonna be learning the short summary of our poem, A Photograph. This poem compares the internal state of nature and the momentary state of humans. In this poem, the poetess describes a photograph of her mother's childhood. In the photograph of time when she went for a sea holiday with her two girl cousins, also, poetess contrasts between nature altering at the pace of a snail and the fast-changing human life. The poet begins when the poetess goes, though her mother's photo that lay within the cardboard boxes. They were possibly uncared for some time. In addition, it is not in any frame, metal, etc. So the poetess portrays it as being susceptible to forces of decay. In the photo, poetess mother seem edged by her siblings who are younger than her. Also, she highlights her mother's strength as she supports her young cousins. They all look into the camera when their brother uncle photograph them. Moreover, they look happy and excited with their throwing locks and pleasant smiles. Further, the picture shows the sea waves smashing at them as the young girls learn to keep up with the waves. The poetess remains with the thought that the sea, even in the motion, her mother is able to resist the change as she has surrendered herself to the mortality. In the second part, in her older days, her mother looks back the day at the sea. Moreover, she remembers her two cousins and recalls the day memorialized in the photograph. Also, she makes fun of her and her cousins' outfits. These lines have a tone of sadness at the mother tries to accept the continual motion of life as she grew older. Looking back at her 12 years old self maybe was an attempt to return to her childhood which is a painful reminder of the time and age. In the third part, the poetess remembering her mother as she died earlier. Further, the photo scripts a memory for both. As it knocks the mother and the daughter together, even after her mother has left her for forever. The poetess confesses that the photo bliss at imagining the mother's laughter, much like her mother's delight in remembering the days at the sea. Moreover, she notices that the time over since her mother's final departure is the same as her age in the photograph, which is 12 years. Maybe it is a coincidence or an irony of life and death. Eventually, both poetesses and her mother learn to accept the change and make peace with their memories. Even though they reminded them of the briefness of laughter, happy moment, etc. Although the death or end makes things go quiet and empty. However, the poetess find her mother died to be loud and inspiring enough to pour her feelings out in the form of a tribute and a poem. Thus, even though death finishes everything, but her mother's death brings out a new response in her. Lastly, she accepts silently her resignation to the final silence of the death. In this poem, the poetess wants to say that death is unavoidable, so embrace your life.